Welcome or welcome back on C-Square. In this example, we're gonna look to write some uh, congruent statements about this uh, rigid transformation, rigid motion we have here. So, if you notice, triangle RTP is the image of FDE, okay, and uh, after rotation of 270 degree counter. Why? So this guy was rotated to 70 and we get this guy. But that's, that's just the beginning of the study. What they want us is to write the corresponding congruent statement. And we'll look at here. I'm, I'm going to start to piece RTP and FDE, right? And if you want to put a triangle in front, that's good. But let's take a look to the letter. They tell you, they don't really have to look to the picture, look to the order of the letters. RT congruent of FD. That's his one statement. RP congruent with FE, right? FE. Then TP congruent with D. So be consistent in the way you choose the letters, and you should be fine. Of course, you can take a look to the picture now if you want and see if that is correct. But uh, this statement here should tell you what you need to write. Also, that statement is going to say what? Angle R. Congruent to angle R. Yeah, those are corresponding angles. Angle T is congruent to angle D. Angle P congruent to angle E. And the final statement will be about these two triangles. Triangle RTP, triangle RTP, congruent with triangle FDE. Those are the statements you can write, the congruent statements you can write about this uh, rotation, 270, about all the rigid transformation, in fact. Um, if you enjoyed these videos, don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help. Thank you.